Welcome back to the channel. I am super excited today because I get to announce a contest and this one is near and dear to my heart. It's actually my contest. Let's jump into it. You may recall that I, uh, on the side as a hobby, I build and design custom game controllers for people with physical disabilities. I've been doing this for a while and every time I post one of these game controller mods out there, people are always asking, how can I help? I've tried a bunch of things over the years, but I think this contest might be the perfect opportunity for people to help in the, uh, the goal of aiding in accessibility in gaming. So, what's the contest? Well, in short, design custom snap-on parts for game controllers to help people with physical disabilities, and you could win a Prusa Mini 3D printer or some rolls of filament from Prusa. If you're impatient and you just want to jump straight in and find all the details yourself, there's a link in the description below for the contest page that breaks everything down, has examples, an FAQ, and all of the uh, information that we need. All right, if you're still here, let me explain what I'm looking for and what's going on. You see, we want to make snap-on modifications for game controllers for people with physical disabilities or non-standard hand positions. That means like if you game by setting the controller down like this and putting your hands on top, or maybe you only have one hand or something like that. There are examples on the contest page. Uh, the big important part here is that these are non-destructive. They're snap-on. You see, when I have to open a controller and modify it, I'm really reducing the life of the controller, the ergonomics of the controller, and stuff like that. It also takes skill to be able to solder in parts. I'm hoping to alleviate those issues. With snap-on parts, those are parts that would simply click on or be added to without modifying the controller. Let Microsoft spend the millions and millions of dollars in research and development and user testing to get these controllers to last a long time. Let's uh, just snap parts onto them instead of reducing their lifespans. This also decreases the skill that's required to install them. So in theory, a snap-on part could be printed and mailed to somebody and either they or a caregiver could just snap it on without having to know how to solder or have the fine motor skills to do the tiny wires and stuff like that. So who's gonna be judging this contest? Well, I have an awesome lineup. There are six people other than myself. You know who I am already, so let me just blast through them real quick. There's more detail and links to their individual stuff on the contest page. First up, we have Bryce Johnson, one of the co-creators of the Microsoft Accessibility Controller. There's Christine Getman from Magic Wheelchair, the people who make those awesome co uh, costumes for wheelchairs. Christian DeRemer, a Twitch streamer who you should definitely go check out. Sam Need and his father Bobby. Sam is six years old, has cerebral palsy, and loves playing video games. I am curious to hear what he thinks about some of these. Stefan Herman from CNC Kitchen with his fantastic analytical mind. And Matt Stoltz, who you probably already know from back when he used to work with Make doing all of our awesome 3D printer testing. Now he's over at Prusa doing fantastic stuff with the community. So all you have to do is take the next month to design an awesome thing. I have examples and, and inspiration on the contest page. Design something that clips on, that helps somebody with a non-standard hand position and upload it to Prusa printers. There's a contest page for this. Simply upload your file. After your file is published, you'll see a button to be able to add it to the contest. Get those projects in by January 1st, and we'll announce the winners on January 15th, I believe, on uh, Make Scene in a blog post, as well as at the link below on the controller project. I hope to see you participating. Uh, I hope that this helps people and inspires people. Click the link down below to find all the information on the contest. I'll see you next time.